Yes, so we're getting into the holiday spirits and counting down the days with our 12 drinks. We'll show you some festive and fun non-alcoholic drinks to make for your guests this season. And joining us to share three recipes today is Kylie Boyanowski from Angelo's Palace Pizza. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you so much for coming in. And just so everyone knows, these are actually mocktails, but you're also going to give a suggestion if yes. they did want to add yeah. some alcohol to it. So I'll be drinking the mocktail versions, but the first one we're doing is Rudolph's Winter Wonderland. What's going to be going into it? Okay, first, I'm actually going to let you try and pour some All of right. these things in for me. Um, we put a little bit of blueberry juice. Blueberry juice. So I've never had it. What does it taste like? It's sweet. Okay. Um, it kind of reminds me of grape juice. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. I like that. <laughs> and what goes next? We're going to add a little bit of lemonade. Hmm. Some tartness to it. Yeah. Otherwise, it would be a little too sweet. Perfect. And then to make it a little red, pomegranate, a little more Christmassy. Yeah. And a little Rudolph. I mean, what would it be without, without a little red? <laughs> right? And just a splash? Yes. That's perfect. I actually splashed on that splash, so I'm really proud of myself. <laughs> I'm just going to shake this up, and then we're going to actually top it with Sprite. Okay. I just don't want to shake it with the soda again. Yeah, you'll make a mess. Probably. <laughs> probably not you. Probably me would be the one making the mess, so. <laughs> and add a little bubbly. Mm -hmm. Perfect. Oh, nice. I'll give it a little whirl. Let me know what you think. Oh, it smells very nice. That's delicious. How do you like the blueberry? I really like it, and you're right. It Good. is kind of grape juice, and the pomegranate really balances it out. And if people did want to make this alcoholic, what would they add to it? I suggest like a light rum. Mm -hmm. I use the Bacardi. Nice it and goes easy. really well. Perfect. All yeah. right, our next drink is Frosty's White Chocolate Dream. What's going to be going into this? Well, first for this one, we've already pre-made the mixture, but mm -hmm. we melted some frozen fresh berries okay. with white chocolate chips. Delicious. We simmered those together. Um, you can actually put those in here if you'd like. All right. Just a scoopful? Yeah. See you later. Oh, it smells so good. It smells like a pie or something. <laughs> We're going to add um, milk to it. Actually, if you just want to put one more spoonful, that's All right. fine. Don't mind if I do. I like berries and chocolate. <laughs> there we go. We're going to shake this one. So this is really like a dessert. Sweet, creamy. Yes. This one is definitely, as you can see, it yeah. definitely foams when you shake it. It's that a little smaller because it's got all the, the berries. berries going and on. You can in. put the whipped cream on top if you oh, like. Oh, very fun. I mean, what is it with that whipped cream, <laughs> right? Definitely adds to oh, it. I didn't shake it very well. Let me shake again. This is why I'm not a bartender and <laughs> I don't do this professionally. Oh. <laughs> Once again, point proven, Kylie, you can kick me out. All right. <laughs> I'll be doing that, making a mess, and trying my, my masterpiece. <laughs> it still looks great. And I've got a mustache like Santa Claus, so that tastes delicious. And if people wanted to add a little something to this, what would they put? Um, I suggest the white cream de cocoa. Okay. It goes well with the white chocolate chips. Yeah. Delicious. And All it's right. not too strong. Our last one is the Elves Cinnamon Cider Eggnog. Yes. Sounds like Christmas to me. <laughs> Tell us what happens. All right, so what we I did was made eggnog from scratch. Mm -hmm. I already made it so I didn't have to crack the egg over here. Um, so it's just a raw egg with a little bit of milk, and then sugar is already inside. And then I'm going to add the cinnamon to it. This one I'm not going to shake because I've already shaken up the egg. And I'm going to top it with a little bit of apple cider. Ooh and the cinnamon on top, so it gives it a nice little garnish. So. It looks lovely. I love it right there. Looking good. And if people did want to add a little something to this, what would the it be? The brandy definitely kicks up the eggnog a little bit. I can only imagine. Well, I'm going to take your word for it. And thank you so much for joining us here and helping thank us you. make all these drinks. And you can check out all of our 12 drinks recipes online now. Just head to WPRI.com and click on The Roadshow.